Kenosha's mayor estimates it will take millions to rebuild after last week's unrest. While the city waits for state or federal help, the city itself is starting to get started. Cassidy Williams with more on how local business is doing its part. Back to school is a busy time of the year at the lettering machine. Embroidering uniforms and now also making masks. And they're about to get even busier. Oh yeah, we got more shirts coming in today. Taking on a new project. This just felt like the right thing to do. The Kenosha business is printing hundreds of t-shirts, a portion of each sale going to help the city rebuild. Artists and organizations interested can reach out and get a spot on the lettering machine's website. We kind of wanted just to create a hub where everyone can do that and then we can help make sure that the funds get to the right places. For a business not damaged during the unrest, it's their way to give back to businesses that can't say the same. They're also hoping that hundreds of people wearing these shirts will show there is more to Kenosha than what's been dominating the nation's headlines. This is a great town. We've li I've lived here my whole life and there's a bunch of good people here and I don't want people to think that this is Kenosha. It's not normal. What you're seeing is, is not us. This isn't our people. Our people are those beautiful, peaceful protests and um, voicing their concerns. They plan to keep printing as long as there is a demand. Cassidy Williams, Fox 6 News. If you would like more information on this project and how to order, just go to our website, fox6now.com.